the mental process for defending yourself, it's definitely not instinct when you start. You have to practice to reduce your reaction time. My name is Yvette Hofrichter. I'm a technical manager at Honeywell Aerospace, and I teach and practice Krav Maga. Come on, bro, fight, fight, fight! She's a role model in the Krav Maga world, and uh, watching her now use that skill set to lead classes. Running from my attacker, step left! It makes me proud, for sure. Call her the female James Bond, because she just totally shocked me when she told me she wanted to do MMA fighting and Krav Maga, and then she became an instructor in Krav Maga. All right, without the pad, guys, I create space by taking my knee up, and then I send the rest of the leg out. I think her Krav Maga translates well here to work, too, because being an instructor, she got herself in front of people on a regular basis. Going from, you know, a young, shy engineer to a more confident um, manager uh, is definitely a reflection of that. One of my favorite things to do here is the stress drill, is what we call it. You're sort of a monkey in the middle, and you have to take all that in and then start reacting to everything that's going around you because you know you can. Yvette's been with the company about six and a half years. When you have some skills and abilities and you start to demonstrate it, you have the opportunity to move up. I manage the reliability, maintainability, and system safety group. We take a product, we're involved at inception, we help in the development of the design, and then also past introduction, we analyze how the components are doing in the field. She's passionate about her work, and I think one of the most important things about Yvette is she really likes a challenge. So there are some differences between, you know, crunching the numbers at Honeywell and then coming out to Kramaga. We are very aggressive mentally at Honeywell, and then we come here and we become very aggressive physically. <laughs> She brings a lot of characteristics that are a good model for others to follow. When she's presented with problems at work, she figures it out. Just like on the self-defense side, when she's attacked by a bigger, stronger opponent in our training, she doesn't give up, she finds a way to win. I want you vicious, I want you fighting for your life, literally. I have spent my entire career working for Honeywell, straight out of college, and Honeywell has been very good to me. I haven't always stepped up to the challenge, you know, it's something that I've definitely had to grow into, and something that really helped me with that was what I do outside of Honeywell, which is Krav Maga. Yeah. 